Okay. What are we uh, unboxing today, Ben? The uh, Type 96 Bob Marushin, I think it's pronounced. Marushin? Yeah, the Japanese company. Okay. How it's pronounced. And the Type 96 is a part of what army? The British Army. Okay. Uh, one something, I know. That's why they use it now. One of the mm -hmm. most accurate trap rifles ever made. Mm -hmm. Is this gas or spring? Spring. Nice. Shoots the same every time. There you go. I got the uh the uh limited 2005 anniversary. It comes this comes with a scope and buy tag. Whatever. Nice, nice. Good deal. How many uh, feet per second on this thing? Stock at 300, but fully upgradable to like 650. If you 650. Now are you gonna upgrade it? Of course. All right. Just got that little tool for my uh, gas guns. Get the things out. What things? Uh, valves. Get the valves out. For the mags? Yeah. Nice. Got this two-point sling because this thing's heavy. heavy. Is it? Very heavy. What was the weight on the Red Wolf? Uh, I don't remember, but I know it's heavy. All right, heavy enough that you need a three-pointer. Yeah. Okay. It's, it's probably the same weight as. That scar you have. Okay. The wheat hex scar. Mm hmm. That's a nice shiny black. Flat mat, you mean? Yeah. Thing pulls nice. pretty easy. Yeah, like now, the end tip of that, the orange, it's not like a cap like the UTGs, it's actually part of the barrel, is it not? Yeah, it seems like it's part of the barrel. But you know, it, it, seems, it scratches right off. Okay. So, you just have to Work scratch on it off. Sandpaper, some shit like that. I'm so hungry! Hey, Shane. Okay. Comes with one mag? I think only one mag. Alright. Does is there any is there a mag in the body or no? No, they're just the one mag. Mm -hmm. But I already got two mags. Okay. So, as compared to the... Type, what is this, Type 96? Yeah. The 96 they already have, what are you seeing in difference in quality so far? A lot better paint quality. Okay. For sure. How, better, about, the, how about the barrel? The barrel looks better. Okay. Better looking steel. Hey, Kit. The bolt pulls back a lot easier. That's good. That be the Sounds better, I can tell you that, just by hearing it. Now, is the magazine in the same spot or is it somewhere different? Magazine, same spot. Okay. It uses the same mags. Oh, good. So you have three mags now then, right? Yes. Awesome. You said it came with a scope? Yep. Cool. We'll have to zero that in a little bit so we can get some shots off. Scope and bipod. Scope and bipod. Now, unlike a lot of them, they, you don't have to screw into the body. It actually just, it's a quick attach system that goes in the front. Is that right? Is it? Yeah. This right here. You push it in like that. Comes out and in. Okay. And your and your uh, first one, oh, it actually no. broke, right? No. Yeah. So. First one pretty much came broken. Okay. So okay. So it's already winning props on shipping so far. Yeah. Push it down further. Break this one there you go. Too. I think I heard something. Uh, it's probably backwards. Yeah, that's it. Are you sure? Yeah. Oh, nice. Okay, so like already from the real steel, the old one, you had to have the legs facing the same way as the barrel. I think. Yeah. Was that what it was? No, you could go either way. You can flip them around. Oh, okay. Around. Well, this one, it goes like how it is on the real steel. It has to go yeah. backwards. And so. these things aren't spring, so I mean, so you can actually easily adjust them to a mm -hmm. Unlike the other one? Yeah, crappy spring. You get like full length and short length. Mm -hmm. So like on the fly or uh, or precise adjusting, it's actually better, right? Yep. Alright. And then the scope that they gave us. And it came with a speed loader, the stick speed loader. Yeah. Right here. The weight tube and an Allen wrench. Uh, unjamming rod. Extra long on jamming rod because that's a long barrel. Scope is uh, a bit smaller. 
It looks a bit better. Those come with mounts? I'm not seeing any mounts. Six to forty says. Six by forty? Yep. I don't think the camera's gonna pick it up unless I flip it into macro and I can't do that right now. Those appear to be the mount boxes then. Yes. Okay. Hopefully. Yep. Yep. So it does come with mounts if you are thinking about purchasing this rifle. Although since this is the 25th anniversary of 2005 was their yeah. 25th, so it might be out of stock. Yeah, well I'm not gonna put the scope on just yet. Not just yet. That's for that's gonna later. Take a little longer. So yeah. So all of the, all of this that you get for this Maruzan 25th anniversary Type 96 Spring in the OD, how much did this run you on RedWolf.com? I think 384. With $70 for shipping. With $70 like, for shipping. You can do a cheap shipping, like land shipping. That mm -hmm. takes about, I think, four to ten weeks to get here. I'm not that patient. But, yeah, you got to remember, guys, this is across seas, so it's going to hit a Hong boat Kong. or something in Hong Kong. So. I'll well, give you some BBs. And BBs and a manual. We're not going to use those BBs, though. No. Some, so does it have a target? Uh, that's a speed light. Yeah, it has a little target. Okay, cool. So all this, 300 and, what was it, 80, you said? Yeah. 380. Well, the gun's 380. Everything total was like 410. 410. So 410 with the shipping. Yeah. Not bad. And it came uh, disassembled, so you will have to assemble some stuff. And was there any screws that you had to tighten down to get the barrel on there, or is that just sitting on it oh, right now? It's just sitting on it right there. All right, so there are screws, yeah. So we may go into that, we may not. All right. Maybe. That's pretty much it. Any uh, final thoughts here, Ben? Nope. All right, cool. And there's Shane. I'm high. <laughs> <laughs> All right.